Okay, so I haven't taken the time to vacuum my house, and I ha it's pretty much a mess, but I just wanted you to kind of see, I thought, well, it's terrible to not have lighting on here at all, but um, maybe if I turn on a few light or so, uh, we don't have very much light in our house to begin with. Um, so, oh my gosh, that is just gorgeous. Um, a friend of mine actually painted this picture for me. Um, it related to one of my other favorite Bible verses and she wrote that on the back and it's so special. Um, but that is the wall that I was thinking I could put it on. You know, I just really wanted to be able to, you know, see it in the other room, but it would be gorgeous there. And it actually has more to me of a green hue to it than it does blue. I hate green at this point in my life though. I just, I used to have it. These ugly green couches have been here forever. Um, well, for 20 years, almost of marriage that we've had these chairs, these sofa and chairs, and I don't, never liked them. But anyway, you know, we're not going to get them that, but this is the room that we, um, bought the chase and we were thinking about putting the chase in this corner here going out. Um, and then maybe a club chair, you know, maybe here. Um, and I don't really know, you know, maybe float it somehow, but I'm really not sure. Um, so this um, a big empty space. So what happens is without having furniture in it, you know, you see the blue, blue, blue of the carpet. Um, it really stands out. And then you see the piece, which is, was going to go um, here on this wall. And that was from other stuff that was hanging the little nails. Um, but so it was going to go on this big wall um, here. And that's why the size of it is so perfect. I mean, the whole thing is just y'all are, I cannot even believe I've never seen anything like it before. And, um, I just think it's just stunning. Um, so that's where it was going to go um, in this room. And so maybe once we get the furniture situated and maybe when we cover up the rug lot, <laughs> maybe, and that's my dad's dog who after he passed away, she became our doggy. I helped him adopt her last summer. That's sweet Sophie. Um, so anyway, but y'all are just so sweet and so patient and you know, I really, I, I, I mean, at this point, you know, y'all have taken so much time for me. It's like, if I could sell it here and just do a whole reorder and pay everything again, I would do it, um, just so that I'm not putting y'all through any trouble or time, um, any more than you already given me. Um, but I do appreciate your reply back and I'm going to see if I can send this to you and, um, kind of get your thoughts here. We've got that going on there and we've got that going on there, um, which came from my parents' house. And then, so this wall there is where I'm wondering. And again, you know, I would see it every time I walk through the house. And so while it wasn't the original purpose, it could certainly go there and be gorgeous. So it's not out of the question that, you know, that it stays. Um, and if you're saying there's no other blue, then I don't know. Um, but anyway, y'all are great. And I will follow up with you in September. Thank y'all so much. Bye-bye.